everybody. Uh, I know it's been a while, um, but I've been kind of busy with school and uh, dealing with adult stuff. So, um, um, this is going to be my haul for last week and this week. Um, so, I'm going to start with my stuff that I got last week. Um, I got... <coughs> I got three skeins of this Burnett Baby yarn. It's like a blue-white mixture, and I used it to make this baby blanket for a friend of mine who is um, having her baby boy um, sometime on Monday. She's being induced, so congratulations to her. I'm so excited. Um, let's see, and then... I got some clay. They were having a 4 for 5 sale, so I got four E Cruz because I've been wanting to try that out um, to make some chibis or whatever. Um, two Spanish olive. Primo, of course. I don't buy Sculpey unless I have to. Call me elitist, but whatever. Uh, and some more black. <coughs> um, and then this week. I kind of just went crazy. So, you kind of have to forgive me. So, um, I bought, um, I bought a pattern, um, that I wanted to try, and I needed an N hook. This is, um, American size N, or, um, well, N as in November, and, or it's a 9 millimeter for in European standards. It's by Yarnology. This is my N hook. I haven't opened it yet, because I haven't started on that project, but it's big! Oh my goodness! Um, this sugar and cream yarn in white for this pattern that I got. Some ribbon, some white gross grain ribbon uh, by Celebrate It for this uh, baby blanket. You can see it right here um, in between these little thingies in between those stitches <laughs> and, then, and then some blue um, strawberry yarn uh, it's three eighths of an inch thick so is this one also I celebrate it uh, the whimsy cottage collection and this is um, the basic narrows collection I don't know if you can see that it's kind of glary and it's kind of going to be kind of yellow because I'm doing this at two o'clock in the morning um, another uh, celebrated Whimsy Cottage of the um, blue strawberry kind of kind of thing. Yeah. Anyway, um, my new toy that I'm so freaking excited about. Uh, they're pom pom makers. I am horrible at making pom poms. Um, I've tried numerous times and they just never turn out. But this, uh, it comes with two sizes, one to make a three or a one and three eighths inch pom pom and the one and one to make a one and five eighth eighth inch diameter pom pom. Uh, this is the larger one. If you guys want a tutorial on how to use these, <laughs> I'd be happy to make one. Um, there aren't very many really good ones out there. Um, but they work like this. They open up. You wrap the yarn around it and pull it apart. But um, I could do an in-depth one if you guys would like. Just comment and let me know. But because of the size, um, they come in many other sizes. There are two sizes that are smaller than, th than this one. And then there are two sizes that are larger than this one. And then there's also heart heart-shaped pom-poms that I'm going to um, get off of Amazon because they're cheaper than getting them at, the, <laughs> at my at my craft store. So yeah, I'm a cheapy cheapo. Okay, and then this week at Michael's, I don't know if you guys know, but they were having a a 99 cent clay sale. I kind of splurged more than I should have, um, but whatever. Um, the sale's over now since it's Saturday and they're closed. Well, it's Sunday now, but whatever. Um, I kind of just replenished some colors that I was running low on and grabbed some new ones for 
my Christmas collection that I'm getting ready to start. I'm so excited! But, um, this purple, um, it's Sculpey, I know, I don't really buy Sculpey, but, um, Prima doesn't have purple. <laughs> um, they have a sparkly purple, but that's about it. They don't have, like, a purple purple. Um, I, most of this is Sculpey because Sculpey just doesn't, or Prima just doesn't have some colors that Sculpey has. Like this suede brown. This is a brand new color. I've never tried this. And I think it's actually brand new to Sculpey as well. Let's zoom in so you guys can see that. Um, it's kind of like a, it's a really dark brown, but it's really pretty and I can't wait to try it out. Oops. Stand up. Uh, also, two of this chocolate brown. I'm also in Sculpey. Um, I'm pretty sure this is also new to the Sculpey brand as well. Um, I know they introduced uh, quite a few new colors um, since they discontinued some. Like my favorite color, the pale pistachio, but whatever. Um, whatever. <laughs> uh, this Primo, it's um, Alizarian Crimson Hue. It's a really dark, purpley, maroon, reddish, pretty elephant. <laughs> um, this raw sienna in Primo, and this burnt umber, also in Primo. Uh, I got two um, denim blue. Primo, and then uh, two Primo Rhino Gray, two Primo Copper. Now I have I had another thing of copper, and it was actually a million times darker than this. Um, this is actually really light compared to the one that I have. Hold on, I'll grab it. This is a copper that I already have by Primo, as you can see. It's a very, very old package. Like, this is way old, but it's actually still pretty squishy. Um, but you can see, oh, you can't really see it, but um, it's really dark. It's really dark compared to this. And they're both copper. Copper copper. They're not the same number though. I don't know. Um, it's a mystery to me. <coughs> this antique gold. Eh, my camera doesn't do the do the color justice, but um it's really pretty. And then this 18 karat gold that I got from Hobby Lobby, I also had to pay, well I didn't pay full price for it, but um, I would have if I didn't have a 40% off Hobby Lobby coupon. Yeah, just for a $2.75 block of play, but um, again, I'm a cheapo, and I had to use my coupon for this. Um, I hope I can grab another one soon and start on my Christmas stuff. <coughs> now, um, I wanted to show you guys for my pom pom makers, um, just what I've what I made. Um, first, I made this yellow one. I love this. Um, and then I made this this one. Um, this one's out of cotton yarn, and this one's out of, this one's out of acrylic yarn. And I said, uh, I don't know. I don't like this one. Looks like poop. <laughs> uh, the acrylic ones are really really pretty. Um, I'll go more into depth with it if I do a tutorial if you guys want. But yeah. Um, sorry for my mess today. This is my husband's desk and I'm kind of zoomed out because there's a little lot of crap. Um, and his desk is always kind of just messy. And it's very small compared to mine. So yeah. But um... Thanks for watching. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And as always, happy crafting!